So you guys see me play music all the time. You know, I'm up leading worship. I'm up before the people, I'm up singing, and I'm, and I'm coaching other folks and, and leading other folks. But uh, you probably don't know how I got my start. Well, I got my start in music um, through, uh, through guitar. The first instrument I, that I played was guitar. And how I began playing guitar was I was, I was in Brooklyn, New York. I was a teenager uh, in my early, early teens. And a guy joined the church uh, whose name is Emmanuel Mack. Well, he had come off the road uh, as a, a blues guitarist, you know, a guy who plays the, the style of blues. Um, and I just, I saw him playing. He came to the church and began to play at the church. And I saw him playing, and you know how it is when you're a young person and you see something and you're like, that is something that I wanna do, that I've gotta do, and I'll give my life to learning that, you know, if, if I can get somebody to teach me. Uh, so I was just at that point, and I never forget, you know, asking Emmanuel, will you teach me guitar? Uh, I was in a single parent home. Um, we didn't have a lot of money. I think he knew that. He never even asked for anything, but he made the mistake of, of moving around the corner from me uh, to, an, to an apartment around there. And I spent hours and hours at his house, and he would just teach me. And I'll just never forget the, the, the Gibson, this old Gibson guitar that he used that was all scarred up and everything uh, to teach me how to play the guitar. And he literally showed me the chords. He showed, told me the chord names. Uh, he told me how to strum, and this is how you do this, and this, how you, this is how you get that sound. And I'm telling you, it just, it's like my life was changing as this guy is showing me um, this thing that's really going to change my life. Um, and it really has blessed my life. And I've felt God uh, challenging me through the years, you know, to, to, to take, this, take this gift and use it, use it um, not just for yourself, but use it for others. Um, even a, a, a couple of weeks back, you know, a young man came into our rehearsal and he plays drums. Um, and I just, I could tell God was challenging me again. You know, I want you to work with this person. Um, he's done that throughout my life and I've been able to share it with others. Not just up in front of people uh, singing or, lead, or leading worship, uh, but to, to maybe take some folks and just show them this is, this is how this, this gift, if you will, is transferred to somebody else and just let their life uh, be blessed. And uh, uh, here recently, this, this past weekend, as a matter of fact, um, you know, I had, I had learned recently that Emmanuel uh, had gotten sick and, uh, and I didn't realize how sick. In fact, he's, he's being taken care of by some loved ones, but he's at the point of he really should be in hospice care. Uh, but I got a chance to see him one last time. So I tell him that, man, I want you to know that what you did for me really blessed my life in ways that you just couldn't imagine. And it went, you know, it, it blessed other people and I was able, it, from what you did, it spun off and it blessed so many people. And he said, son, you know, the way you can thank me is to just pass it on. So um, I just hope that I can continue sharing this gift with others in that way.